So now that we have our angle at centre, we can start uh, constructing our pie chart. Now you're going to have to use a protractor for this, which I don't have, but I'm going to sort of talk you through what I would do. So the first thing I'm going to do is work out the uh, uh, work out how big a chunk of this pie EastEnders would be. So it's 90 degrees. So I would get my protractor, uh, line up the protractor to the zero line here. So I've got zero degrees, and so that the centre of the protractor is here. And then I would count round, looking at the 10 and 20, until I got to 90 degrees. Now you should remember that 90 degrees forms a right angle. So my first bit of pie chart would be here. Okay, and then I would label this, let's just call it east at the moment. We could put east enders in. Now for Emma Dow's 120 degrees. So now I would rotate round my protractor so that this time the zero line is on the line that we've just ended. So on this line here, that's where you've got your zero. And then you count round, so you count past 50 and past 90, the right angle, to where you can see 120, okay? Where 120, you draw a line, right? And this is Emmerdale. And then lastly, again, I would put my protractor, put my protractor so that the zero is on this line here, and then I would count round all the way, so I'd so I would uh, go past 20 degrees, 30, 40, 50, 90 degrees might be about here, 120, and then hopefully I'd see 150 right at the back where I started at, and then I would label this curry. They've got I've got my um, completed um, pie chart which has been labelled.